Hi there, it's Lior here. Thanks for joining me today. Welcome to the Reading Project. Today's book is Duck Gets a Job by Sonny Ross. Let's check it out. This is Duck. Duck wanted a job. All Duck's friends had jobs in the city and they never stopped talking about them. I love spreadsheets. Me too. You should come and work in the city with us, Duck. So Duck looked at the ads for city jobs. They seemed boring, but he applied anyway, and he got an interview. He couldn't decide what to wear to the job interview. He didn't want to make a bad first impression. He opted for a professional look. Cool, professional, natural. Next, Duck had to decide how to get there. Flying would make him tired and sweaty, but public transportation is tricky for ducks. He chose to walk. He got lost. When Duck finally arrived in the city, he had to get a taxi so he wouldn't be late. In the taxi, he gave himself a pep talk. Calm down, be cool, be yourself, relax. In the interview, Duck wasn't cool, professional, or relaxed. He was very nervous, but he got the job. Duck soon realized that spreadsheets full of facts and figures did not interest him at all, though he did have a nice nap. Before he left that night, Duck quit. He had always wanted to be an artist, so Duck found an ad for a job that better suited his interests. Ceramics, fashion, comics, illustration, design, photography, art, writing? For his interview, he dressed in his natural look and put samples of his best work in a portfolio. He checked his route to make sure he didn't get lost, and he left plenty of time so he wouldn't be late. He showed his work and he wasn't nervous at all. He felt confident because he was being himself. Duck got the job, he was very happy. Duck loved his new job. There were no spreadsheets. Duck was happy that he decided to follow his dreams. Resume. Name, Duck. Skills, quacking, drawing, being waterproof. My name is Duck and I would like a job. My friends work in the city and never stop talking about it. So any job please, Duck. P.S. Creative job preferred. The end. Thank you so much for joining me. Come back and see our reading project again. Don't forget to subscribe and hit the notification bell. See you next time.